Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Bite. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is Teenage Hacker Arrests. Since it's Friday, I'll keep today's story quick and light by just giving you a quick update on yesterday's story. If you saw the video yesterday, you know that a hacker actually infiltrated a Department of Justice web portal and used it to steal the employee records for tons of FBI and the Department of Homeland Security employees and then leaked that on the internet. Today, the UK police actually arrested two teenagers in association with this attack and a few others you might remember. In fact, you've probably heard of me talking about the group Crackers with Attitude, or CWA. These were the hackers that actually hijacked the CIA director's email and a couple other intelligence folks' email as well. They apparently are also the ones that did this particular DOJ hack that I talked about yesterday. In any case, the UK authorities actually arrested two teenagers that they think are associated with CWA, and one of those teenagers has already been released on bail. Now, there's really no practical takeaway to this story other than it's good to see authorities actually tracking down and trying to catch cyber criminals. That said, remember these two teenagers are just suspects so far. Uh, we can't assume they're guilty until they're proven guilty. Guilty. Now, the CWA has reacted to this. They've gone to Twitter and said, despite these teenager arrests, their friends being arrested, they will continue to do these attacks. In fact, they say they're going to up these attacks because of the arrests. Anyway, it will be interesting to see how this case continues to develop, whether or not these two are proven guilty, and whether or not the CWA delivers on their promise to continue these sorts of attacks. Now before I finish, do know Monday is a US holiday, so I won't post a video on Monday. Until I see you next time, enjoy your weekend, enjoy Valentine's Day, and if you're in the US, enjoy President's Day. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.